Hi, and welcome to the channel. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to remove and change the background in Canva. So here, I've just got a very simple design. And the first thing to note is we've got two elements in here. We've got the text here. And if you click behind, you can see there is a background. Now to remove the background, all you simply need to do is select it and press the delete key. But the other thing to understand, I'm going to go back one by clicking on this arrow here. The other thing to understand is if I click on the background, I can go to this icon here that says position. And over here, I can go onto this drop down called layers. And in here, it will show you all of the elements in your design. So you've got your canvas here, then you've got your background, and then you've got your text. And you can move these around. Obviously, you can see now my text has disappeared and the background now becomes the background again. So in order to change the background, you can use lots of different elements. You can use shapes, you can use pictures, you can use gradients, it's completely up to you. So if I just delete the background and I go to elements, I can go down to shapes and click on this square. All you need to do is resize it. Then go to position, go to layers again, and then simply put the background underneath the text. And then if you want to make alterations to this box, go to color and you can either just simply click on a color down here or you can click at the top here and find a color of your choice by using this cursor or this slider here to change the actual color itself. Or you can go down to the bottom and click on gradient. Now you can click on one of these out of choice. Let's select this one or you can click on any one of them and customize them. Now currently the gradient's running left to right, but simply by going down to this icon, you can turn it around so the gradient will go in the other direction, or you can have it diagonally and just increase the size of it. So if you want to change the colors of this gradient, simply click on the color at the top here and it will appear at the top, this gradient, but it will appear with some filters here. So click on this again. You can change the look of your gradient by clicking on one of these and the direction and by clicking on one of the colors you can then go ahead and change this color and what's great is there's a live preview so you can simply scroll through the colors move the cursor and select the color of your choice if you don't want a gradient just delete that and then go back to elements and then scroll down we can go to photos click on see all and then you can simply type in something that you want as a background. Let's say we want these buildings. Again, stretch the image out across your page. Go to position, go to layers and you can move it. Alternatively, you can go to arrange and you can click on forwards or backwards, center back, go to front. Any of those will work as well. And then if you want to edit your photograph, you can use any of these options, the filters here, you can go to see all filters, and then you can change the filter on your background. And then more importantly, if you go up to this transparency slider here, you can reduce the look of that image or the transparency of that image, allowing your text to show up more. So I hope that's helped you today. If it has, please like and subscribe and have a great day.